guys, it's Coco and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a really exciting one because I'm actually collaborating with The Teen Runway, which is a blog all about fashion and beauty. So I've actually been reading this blog for about two months now, so not that long, but as soon as I found it, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna love this. I just think it's the perfect place to go if you ever need inspiration of what to wear or like what type of beauty to buy. And it's also great for checking up on current trends. So yeah, I'm gonna leave a link in the description box right at the top so that you can find it easily. So you can go and check it out. And if you do end up going to check out the Teen Runway, then make sure to tell Lauren that I sent you. And yeah, let's just get on into the video. So today's video, as you can tell by the title, is a summer clothing haul. I'm just gonna show you all of the things that I've recently bought because I'm going traveling soon, so I needed to get loads of new clothes. So I'm gonna start with Urban Outfitters because that's my favorite shop. <laughs> So the first top that I got is this green kind of cardigan crop top with long sleeves like this and it's stripy and it buttons up at the front. So this top is quite lightweight, it is knitted so if it is a bit breezy wherever I am, I am going to still be warm so I'll probably wear it on one of those days. The next top that I got is this, again striped. <laughs> um, cross over top okay you cannot even tell what it looks like when I just pick it up like that which has short sleeves and this rainbow striped pattern which I think is so cute again it's knitted but it's short sleeved and cropped so it's still going to be quite cool but yeah I just love how bold the pattern is the third top that I got from Urban is this which I know is absolutely tiny and it doesn't even look like a top but it is um, but it's just this little boob tube or bandeau top, whatever you want to call it, in this mustard colour. I really love this mustard colour because I think it really complements a tan, which hopefully I'm gonna get on my travels. Um, who knows, because I'm pale and I like to burn. Well, no, I don't like to burn, but I just always seem to. And yeah, easy to fit in my rucksack. Anything else from Urban Outfitters? I don't think so. So the next brand that I bought loads of clothes from is Princess Polly, which is an Australian brand. So you better believe that I paid a crap ton of shipping, which I was not expecting, unfortunately. The first payment that I had to pay was three pounds. So I was like, yes, it's only three pounds. And then I got a letter saying that it was actually 50 pounds. So, <laughs> But I gotta say, the clothes are kind of worth it, like they're so nice and nothing like anything that I've ever bought before. And the first one is this tie up top here, it's really creased. So yeah, black with roses on it. It just ties up at the front and then flows quite loosely. It's gonna really keep me cool, again super light to just throw on, but it still makes you look really put together at the same time even though it's just so easy to put on and then the second one that i got in a different color which is like this burnt orange one is this wrap top and you can see the little strings here that tie up at the front again i love this color it's so pretty a bit like the mustard color from the urban top i think it will really oh <laughs> i'm like a 12 year old boy what was i even saying Oh yeah, so like the mustard top, I think this burnt orange colour will make me look really nice with a tan. Those two things might be my favourite things that I've bought in this whole haul. The last piece of clothing that I bought from Princess Polly is this dress. I don't really buy dresses to wear like casually on an everyday basis. So this is actually like really weird for me. It's just this wrap dress, but it has these little ribbony bits that you can tie at the side. And then it's got a low cut down your chest and it's not too short, not too long. My main goal is to be comfortable and I think this dress is perfect for that. I also got these earrings, I don't know if you can see them. It's like this abstract face kind of gold metal faces but I mean my friends have complimented them already so thanks guys but yeah I really love these earrings and I will probably be wearing them like every day. What's next? Yeah, so the next place that I bought clothes from, I think again, is an Australian brand and it's called Gooseberry Intimate. It might be American. I don't know. It's a swimming costume 
and I absolutely love it. Again, there's an orange colour, like a burnt orange colour. So there's a theme going on here. I absolutely love this swimming costume. I don't actually have one. No, I do, but I just look really weird in it. So I probably won't wear that one again, especially now that I've got this one to replace it. Bloody hell. Does my contour look like really crap? Oh, here she comes. You know what, I'm just gonna carry on because <laughs> I don't have time to wait for the clouds. This swimming costume, which I think is super cute. And at the back, it's just spaghetti straps. Absolutely love this swimming costume. It makes me feel really confident. The material is really nice. It's very good quality. It's not like, you know, triangle swimwear. It's definitely not that scuba material that sucks up loads of water and just digs into your skin. It's, I don't know, stretchy. The style just doesn't really go out of style. So I think I'm gonna be good for a long time. The next place that I bought some clothes from is H&M. <laughs> which I don't really shop at that often. I thought I would try it this year and I saw loads of really nice things and they're quite cheap, so I just went for it. Again, I bought two things of the same style, but just a different pattern. And that is, again, two wrap dresses. I don't really push myself that much. If I like something, I kind of just stick to it. But the first dress is this lovely, lovely yellow floral print which again has the little ties to tie at the side and it's a low cut V at the front. This colour is super, super summery and <laughs> don't you just love it? The only problem is I think it might be a little bit see-through. I'll have to sort that out. I don't really know what I'm gonna do. I might have to wear something underneath it so that people can't see me. <laughs> But the next one is better. This is not as see-through. And I love this one as well. Blue is my favourite colour. I think both of those are super girly and pretty and feminine. I'm looking forward to wearing those because I'm not really like that. I don't really wear pretty clothes. I'm more of like a, not a tomboy, but like I prefer to wear like streetwear and stuff. So this is kind of out of my comfort zone. Next is this play suit that I got from H&M in this floral print. This is just a really easy outfit to just throw on and not have to think about anything else. And it's got really nice little details around the hem of the short part. Yeah, it's just little circles that I think are really cute. I keep saying cute, I'm sorry. Love this. The next things that I got from H&M are actually bikini bottoms and a bikini top. So the first thing that I got was this bikini top in this kind of jungle or leafy print. I don't know what it is. It's got a tie at the front and it's kind of like a scoop neck cut and it'll go perfectly well with these bikini bottoms, which are kind of ribbed. I kind of think that everyone needs a pair of black bikini bottoms just because they go with literally any other top. So it's kind of great to just mix and match with them. Really, really like those and can't wait to be in the sun to wear them. So the next thing that I got is from Zalando. It's a really cool place, which I think is a bit like ASOS where it just stocks loads of different brands. And I got this, which is by the brand Dorothy Perkins. And that is this very pretty jumpsuit. It has a tight side, which is really pretty. And it has kind of roughly sleeve um, shouldery bits. This will be really easy to throw on as well to just be a whole outfit without even trying. And also from Zalando, I got these Reebok Classic shoes, which I absolutely love. They're a bit like Nike Air Force, Air Force Ones, I think, but they have a tan kind of color sole. And next to the Reebok logo, there's a British flag, which I really, really like. The white shoe is just gonna go with everything. It's probably gonna get really dirty, but you know what? Who cares? <laughs> the last thing in this haul is a bag. And I got this bag from an outdoor shop because it was way cheaper to get it from there rather than on the actual website. And that is this. I cannot pronounce the name, so I won't. I mean, I can pronounce the Kankin bit. This is the famous Flavlavlum. 
gang and bag. Literally everyone on Tumblr, on Instagram, on YouTube has one. And there's so many different colors. I got the classic size in yellow ochre, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, that is everything that I have to haul for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much to Lauren at the Teen Runway for collaborating with me. Please go and check out her blog. It is really great, especially for teens. And I'm pretty sure all of you watching are teenagers, so perfect for you. If you did enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and I will see you next time. Bye! Yeah.